Every October, when the spook of the season begins to haunt us, memories, histories, and mysteries creep into our lives. At the Keegan's Theater in downtown Vancouver, they embrace this time. It's going to be engaging and terrifying. Bradley Richardson with the Clark County Historical Museum has become quite the ghost storyteller. He knows the story that says Kagan's Theater has ghosts sitting in the front seats after shows and then disappearing when approached. Tell, you know, some of the local tales of terror and some of the, you know, darker side of our history in Clark County. Along with a couple other historians and some paranormal expertise, History on Tap is in its fourth season. As historians, we're, we're pretty buttoned up, you know, about 11 months of the year. And in October, we get to uh, let our hair down and, and, and tell some fun spooky stories. Three segments make up the show. A short Clark County trivia game. One History and a Lie involves two ghost stories where you decide which one is the true history. And Campfire Tales, Bride of Kuvenstein. Brad has included the dark history in his more than 250 Vancouver historic site tours and feels that he's up to telling a scary story. I feel pretty well practiced in the tales of terror. I would really focus on how you you frame the story and you illustrate it with your hands the pace that you go at, how you change your tone. I uh, have a brand new story that no one has ever heard. He would not share the tone of his ghostly tale with me. It's about a hospital bed that was taken from an old house, moved into somebody's home, and from there, really weird things started to happen. While the event is one night only, the next time you're in the theater lobby, you might see a 1930s woman who disappears right in front of your eyes. You have that moment of fear and anxiety, and then you're able to walk away and be safe. Spooked in downtown Vancouver, Washington, I'm Stephen Redman, KGW News.